G'day, thanks for joining us for Saturday Afternoon Football. Anthony Hudson broadcasting live. Fair crowd in to watch this game today. I'm paired in the box here today with Gary Lyon. Welcome, Gaz. Yes, thanks, Hutto. A real pleasure to be here for this game today. Today we have Geelong coming up against Bessenden. of both sides make their way to the middle for the coin toss. Essendon kicking to the left of screen. These lineups look very strong and both teams look fired up and set to go. The fans of both sides are waiting this one. And here we go, it's along. Taking on the Bombers. Show some physicality. The umpire calls for it. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Merritt runs. Slick with the hands. Smooth just bangs away at goal. Henderson to kick it in. Plays on to himself. Looks up with a kick. Couldn't snaffle it. Just dismisses his opponent. Taylor goes by hand. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Takes that one strongly. Hawkins puts it on the boot. Then a goal it marks and a bit of space. Uses it now. Simply outplayed his opponent. Here's a chance for Jenkins. 45 metres out. A goal will see Geelong take the lead. That's a well-executed kick for a goal. He's absolutely loving it. Why not? Gets his first. Smiles all round. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. That's a really good team goal. About to resume hostilities. Guides it down. Tries to release the pressure. He's got the footy in his hands. Now we'll get a ball up. Taps it down. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Goes for territory. Heffel was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Takes an uncontested mark. Redmond has resources out wide. Jenkins with the mark. A low stabbing kick. Rowan looks to get onto the football. Wins the race to the ball. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. One it down. Going for goal number one. Abler goes long and delivers the goal. He acknowledges the crowd. Geelong could kick the last two goals. The lead is now at 11. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement.
We're back in motion. Punched away. Ablett dug out the loose ball. Hurried kick. Finds this and marks well. 45 metres out. Menegola going for number one. He's missed it. The Cats would be happy with this start. Weighing up the options now. They chase after the loose ball. Just threw the ball. Got boot to ball. Hook it with an easy mark. Looking to rebound with the kick. Good grab there from McKenna. Geelong haven't been in control. They've given up way too many uncontested marks and are letting the opposition set the pace. Marks all alone. Ambrose puts it on the boot. Marks in a bit of space. Gets a hand to the ball. Menegola just threw it. Chose to kick it. Good mark, and looks to send it back. Connor Jasnik sends one up towards the wing. Decides to go. Cutler kicks hurriedly. A strong pack mark. Bangs it on the boot now. A great mark taken there. 35 metres out. He likes his chances from here. Started the kick wide, and it never came back. Essendon close the gap to 11. Henderson with the kick in duties. Takes the mark. Guthrie kicks it. Fuse marks. Fuse sends one up towards the wing. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Packs it forward. Easily takes the mark. Stewart with the opportunity in front of goal. 45 metres out. He decides to go for home. The drop punt goes straight between the big sticks. He loved that one. Essendon reduced the margin. About to resume play. Won the hit out. Shield gets the ball. Duncan, interesting handball. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Good mark there. Puts boot to ball. Guthrie determined to reach the ball. Decides to soccer it. Dug out by Stewart. Finding the ball with ease. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent. And it's a free. Move it on. Stewart decides to go for home. He delivers with a drop punt. They get around him after that effort. The Bombers back in front. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Phillips won himself a free. Goes with the kick. The mark has been taken. Moved on by Zah. Finds a target. Cuts the kick inboard. Picking it up was Zaha Rakis. Gathers it now. Just got the hands in the back there. Puts it on the boot. Ends up turning this ball over. McGrath uses it by foot. Hurley has resources out wide. The mark has been taken. Bounces over the line. Looks like we'll have a throw in. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. A great match. Picked up under pressure. Eventually, the ball goes over the line. We'll get a ball in. Thrown in now. Stanley slaps it away. Applying the physical pressure. Un Gary, how did you see that opening quarter? The Bombers deserve this lead early. They'd want to keep it up if they're going to win this.
Here's Gaz to break down the stats. Geelong need to be more efficient with their ball use. They've allowed the opposition too much influence from intercept marks. Players ready to start the second quarter. Back with another centre bounce. Clears the contest. Heffel short by hand. Stephen got him high there. Elects to kick. An easy grab for Smith. Works it across the ground. A chance to reload the attack now. Guthrie goes with the kick. Marked by Delwood. Selwood sends one up towards the wing. Stephen gets on the end of this. Moves the ball along the wing. Rowan looking to track down the footy. Manages to get a hand away. The ball mopped up. Menegolik was taken high in the tackle. Links with hands. That ball comes off the post. It's all level here. Considering the options on the kicky. Drives it out at defensive 50. Marks now and can send it back. He doesn't want to let his teammates down with this shot at goal. Menegolik lines up from long range. Lining up from a 45 degree angle. Moves the ball by foot. Hooker got under it. Has a runner alongside him. Linking by hand. The drop punt sails between the big sticks. Gets some reward for his efforts. Now they lead by six. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. The game is back underway. Stanley with a big fist on it. Rowan leaps over the top. So what can Geelong do with this opportunity in front of goal? He drives it towards goal. What a kick. And he puts it through. Rowan loved kicking that one. Geelong have kicked the last two goals. Geelong lead by two goals. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Essendon have turned it over too often today. They aren't coping with the pressure. They should try and slow it down and control the ball for a moment. Stephen lobs the handball. Intercepted. Hookak missed an opportunity to mark. Sarge Rock, what he should have taken. Henderson picks up the loose ball. No issues with that drop punt. He's enjoying that goal. Geelong, 32, like Essendon, 14. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. Swats it. He's got the football now. Takes the mark. Kick by McKenna. Bused uses the body well. Geelong, Curl allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Hands that ball to the opposition. Fantasia moves it by hand. Taylor just handballs into space. Contests the hard ball. McKenna just put it on the boot. The handball hits the target. Linking by hand. Takes possession. He gets his hands on the footy. Langford failing to get near it. Guys. Well, he hasn't had an impact we were expecting. He loved that one. Essendon now only trail by 12. We're back in the middle now. Hammers it. Shield on the ball. Coughed up by Delwood. Well picked up. We'll get a ball up on the wing. Phillips thrashes it. Picked up by Duncan. Uses it by foot. Dug out the loose ball. Picked up now. Chips it towards half forward. 
great mark. The Cats have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. it clear he gains possession Cutler with the ball Stephen couldn't stick the tackle Hurley could be upset with that the kick from Tart Buse hurried kick Stewart dug it out the free for Stewart Hawkins spills it Dalhouse going for number one Hooker has it Looks to move it by foot. He takes the mark. Looks up with the kick. Just put it on the boot. Slams it onto the boot. Open opportunity for Elfie. Sinks the slipper into it. The handball now from Delwood. It'll be a ball up. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. He wins possession. Opportunity for Guelphie. Thump clear with the ball now. Takes that one strongly. Blitzarves moves it now. Stands tall and marks. Menegola drives the kick. Stewart doesn't take the mark. Mops up the loose ball. Dangerfield looks in need of a spell. Kick goes astray, and it's out on the full. Searches for a teammate downfield. Finds himself in space and marks. Welfie elects to kick. Stuck the bits out there and held onto it. Clearing kick out of the defensive 50. Uses it by foot. Taking a nice grab. Decides to kick. The mark is taken. How did you see the second term, Gaz? Geelong have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. Anything to add, Gaz? Geelong have turned the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Thanks. The game promises plenty. We have a bit. We're set to go at the start of the third quarter. Phillips thumps it forward. Duncan gets on the end of this, just gets it onto the boot. Winning the ball in the air was Hurley. Got boot to ball. Can't take possession. Uses the bump. Hits him hard. Selwood got the hands free. Taylor grabbed it clean. Geelong fans would love to see this one sail through. Can he put it through? Never on target. And a behind. Geelong by seven points. Hooker to bring it back into play. McGrath runs after the ball. And he's missed. Geelong by eight points, searching for a teammate. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Tui can link up through hands. Turned it over. Saad wants to keep it moving by hand. Geelong just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Gained some territory. Henderson gathers it now. Kicks out of the congestion. Dangerfield marks it. Stepped off his line. Hits the target by hand. He's really making an impact in this game, Gaz. He's everywhere at the moment. He just throws that ball. Taylor kicks it to the square. Puts it on the boot. Puts on a bump. Danaher, a bit too casual with the tackle. A solid mark from Tui. Looks to move it by foot. Couldn't complete the mark. Hacking it out of there. Takes a simple grab. 
50 metres out. Henderson with an opportunity for goal. 45 degree angle. A chance to put a second goal on the board. Through for a point. Geelong, but nine. Hooker looking for options now. Redmond controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Dahlhouse didn't mark it. Danaher landed in his back on this occasion. Now with a low spearing kick. Selwood with a chance. If he can keep his cool. Goes with the kick. Drops the mark. Smith coming off for a spell. Ball up called. The players will be feeling it out there. Swatson gathered by Shield. Stanley gets the loose ball. Uses it now. Henderson there to mop up. There'll be a ball up close to goal. Punched away. Has it now. Intercepted. Doing well to intercept that kick. The distance might be just beyond him. Going for goal number one. Good mark by Cockatoo. Ten metres out. Hits the post, and it's a minor. Ten points the difference. Geelong have been poor with their ball use. They've turned it over on too many occasions, and it's allowing the opposition chances to score. Going for goal number one. The kick ends up hitting the post. They are really struggling in front of goal. The lead is now at 11. Looking for options now. Marked by Dangerfield. This will certainly test him from this distance. Lining up from a 45-degree angle. Going for goal number one. Dangerfield almost missed the boot with that kick. Not happy with that kick as it goes out on the full. Slams it on the boot. Strong mark in the contest. 40 metres out. Going for goal number one. Geelong up by a couple of goals. Hookak searching for a teammate. Stands tall and marks. Gleeson with a drilling ball. Easily takes the mark. Puts boot to ball. It's a foot race to get this one. Saad picks up the loose ball. Missed the target. Kicks in heavy traffic. Smith looks for a target inside 50. Under pressure and keeps it alive. And the ball ends up over the line. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. With the ball is Henry. Rushes with the kick. Nobody can hold on here. Gathered by McDonald, Tip and Woody. Blitzar stuck out the loose ball. Gives it to Delwood. He gets another possession. Moves the ball by foot. Buse picks it up. Dahlhouse kicks in heavy traffic. Drops the ball. Picks up the loose ball. Good mark and looks to send it back. Geelong haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Can't take the mark. Ends up marking uncontested. Keeps the kick low. Over the top of the pack. Moves it by foot. Does well to cut off the kick. Elects to kick. Townsend leading the race to the loose ball. Clean pick up by Eiffel. Ambrose slams it onto the boot. Sweeping handball. Stanley couldn't complete the tackle. The ball spells the views. Handballs to no one in particular. Kicks hurriedly. Intercepts the ball well. Gaz, what do you think about that? Geelong will want to keep the foot on the accelerator and finish this last quarter strongly.
What do the stats tell us, Gaz? Essendon, they're intercepting the ball well, but they're not capitalising on the scoreboard. They need to find the ball more at ground level to capitalise on their dominance in the air. Thanks for that, Gary. Umpire ready to begin the final turn. Back in the middle to resume play now. Hammers it. He's got the football now. Sends it clear of the contest. Zaharakis gathers it now. Fantasia does well to mark. Chose to kick it. Dangerfield wins the ball in the air. Manages to get a hand to it. Kick by McDonald, Tip and Woody. Missed from behind. Just under two goals, the difference now. Henderson plays on. He's kicked it out of the full. Zaharakis doesn't want to let his teammates down with this kick. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Going for goal number one. Narrowly misses there. Just two goals in it. Henderson comes short of the next move. Needs a bit of a rest. Doesn't connect with the kick, and it'll be coming back. Colin Jasny coming on. Opportunity once again for Essendon to put one through. Big kick required from this distance. Hurley going for number one. Ball picked up. Walks that one over the line. Essendon now only trailed by nine. The Cats have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. He takes the shot. That one will really be fun. He's enjoying every second of it out there. They get around him after that effort. Essendon have kicked the last three goals. Essendon behind by three. Stanley now. They can link up now. Henderson wins the marking contest. Goes by foot. Finding the ball was dark. Continues to find the footy. Phillips just threw it. Buse looks to convert this opportunity. Testing shot. Outside 50. 45 metres out. They can take the sting right out of the game here. Going for goal number one. Just hits the post and a minor score. The kicking seems to be contagious tonight. Teammates break for him. McKinnick might have overworked himself there. Takes the mark all by himself. McGrath takes it well. With a driving kick. Spent that one before he earned it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, Hunter. Puts the handball out in front. Takes possession. Fantasia steals possession. He has to hold onto those. Looks like the ball will be coming back. He drives it. The ball ends up going to ground. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Not too far from goal here. Just has to kick truly. That kick goes out on the full. Danerg running off for a break. Looks up with the kick. Stewart found some space and marked. Kicks it out of the back half. Taylor wins the ball in the air. Uses it now. The mark is taken by Kyle Jasney. Gets a hand in. Turns it over there. It's a turnover. Is in his possession. He can take off after that handball. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Out of bounds in the pocket. Lots of pressure out there at the minute. Ball back into play. Saad is getting the ball again and again. Saad throws the ball away. He 
heads for home. He makes that kick count full price. Celebrating hard. Geelong beginning to apply their support on the scoreboard with a lead of 45 to 35. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Essendon could get in their hands to the ball. They need to find a way to convert that into scores to get on top in this match. Using every ounce of energy he has left. Stanley with the hit. McGrath collects it. And we'll get a ball up. Thump clear. Snaffled up by Dart. Kicks hurriedly with a driving kick. Goes for the goals. You can see that happening right after it left his boot. And they continue to miss these opportunities. Geelong, but 11. Hookak weighing up the options now. Using every ounce of energy he has left. Puts it on the boot. Finds a target. He drives it. Terrific mark there. McGrath with a poor kick out of play. Selwood uses it by foot. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Good mark there. Spears the ball. The ball goes over the boundary on the wing. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaines? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Needs a bit of a rest. Drives it long. Elects to kick. Smith moves it now. Henry kicks it out, and the ball will be coming back. A chance to put one through for his side. 40 metres out. A spearing kick. Great grab. 35 metres out. Kapler delivers with a straight drop. Essendon so close, but couldn't quite get the win. Gary, any final thoughts? It was one of those games that could have gone either way, Hutto. Good teams find a way to win close games, and that's what we saw today. Thanks for that. Final scores at Geelong 6 10 46. The Bombers 6 5 41. That's all the time we have for today. It's been a great day of football, and we'll see you again soon.